Ashley is embarrassed and exhausted by Mike's drug habit, which he tries to hide from his daughter, yet Mike appears very proud of his addiction because this was a selfie video he made just a few days ago. Take a look at this. Mm, so I just did my last shot of heroin. <sighs> Fortunately, my wife was mad at me because I needed to go get another fix again. And so I went and she thought I was getting pills, but I was getting heroin. Ashley says she doesn't know what it will take to get through to Mike, but she says today is his last chance. And my question is, what will it take to get through to her? How did it get this bad for Mike? Take a look. Mike's addiction has gotten so bad to the point where I feel like he's going to die. My tolerance is so high, I'm going to end up overdosing. Mike injects prescription medication in heroin and cocaine. Well, I enlisted in the Marines in 2010. During the second phase of boot camp is when I fell and hurt my back. And subsequent L5 par fractures treated with regimen of opioids and muscle relaxants. Because of the amount of drugs that they were giving me, I became extremely addicted. I feel the rush from heroin but it's nothing like the, the Lord is. I'm having to do three, four pills in one shot multiple times a day. So switching to the heroin, I could stretch that out to about maybe a day or two, but now it's only lasting me for like a day. And when I wake up the next day with nothing, I'm a monster. He fiends and he sees red. <laughs> Yesterday, I was pretty desperate for drugs. I asked Ashley if she would give me the money and she told me no. So I went out and sat behind the car so she couldn't leave. And I said, I can go and break every window in the house. And then she sent the money. Mike has stolen my iPad, TVs, computer, multiple times. He's stolen money. A few years back, I robbed someone at gunpoint in the middle of McDonald's drive-thru. Mike has been arrested three times. Jail definitely doesn't scare me. Damn sure I haven't learned my lesson. What are you doing? Calling my heroin dealer. This isn't the life that I want to live. So let me ask you, when was your last fix? Yesterday. I actually left the hotel and took the Metro line down to Skid Row so right. that I could score some heroin at, on Skid Row. Right. What time? 4.30. Uh-huh. And you just got enough for one? To get me through to yesterday, last night, and I haven't had anything today. OK. You getting jittery? Not yet. When are you going to tell her the truth? You have no intentions of stopping. I do have intentions. I need to stop. Come on. You, you can wool her around and blow smoke at her, but you can't blow smoke at me. You're stealing from her. When you steal from her, you're stealing from your daughter. I'm stealing from my family. And I watched this video you made. So this is fun and games, right? It's not fun and games. Well, let's play the video. So I just did my last shot of heroin. <sighs> Fortunately, my wife was mad at me because I needed to go get another fix again. And so I went and she thought I was getting pills, but I was getting heroin. I'm so disappointed. But you say you don't want to know, right? You said I, I, you don't realize when he steals from you. You don't know about the street drugs, where he goes when he leaves. You didn't know uh, 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 about the overdosing. You, you say you, you don't really want to know. It's not that I don't really want to know. It's that he keeps it from me. He will tell me that he is going to work, and he's gone for eight hours a day. 10 hours a day, comes back. I do do a very good job of hiding it. He does a very good job of hiding it. Only if you don't want to see the truth. Come on. 